Hello, and welcome to Quiz Coconut's Quick Fire Quiz Pod with me, James Cutler. In 2014, I launched Quiz Coconut, and we've since hosted over 2,000 pub quiz nights. Each episode, I pick 10 of our best questions so you can improve your general knowledge, boost your brain power, and learn some useful and useless facts. Answers will be revealed at the end of the episode, and there's one rule. Don't use Google. Use your coconut! Welcome back, quizzes. Thanks for tuning in to another QuizPod episode. We're straight into it. 15 points available over 10 questions. Number one is a true or false question. Here we go. Pigeons can tell the difference between a Picasso painting and a Monet painting. True or false? That's a fantastic question to start with. And number two is a bit more sensible, and it goes like this. Which distance measures 1.15 miles? Question three is a three-point question. I will give you the names of three phobias. Tell me the fears related to the phobias. They all begin with the letter A. Aerophobia. Arithmophobia. And anthophobia. So once again, aerophobia, arithmophobia, and anthophobia. Tell me the fears for one point each. That was question three. Moving on to question four, but remember you can always pause the pod if you need more time with any of these questions. Number four. In which country does Nestle chocolate originate? Number five. Music. Which of David Bowie's albums featured the name of a Disney character? Okay, we're halfway through. How are we doing so far, folks? Let's go on to number six. Number six is a very interesting question. Which is the last letter to be added to the English alphabet? Hmm... So I reckon you could probably narrow it down to a few. Which is the last letter? It was added in 1524. Number seven is a three-point question all about cars. We are looking at 2023 statistics, and I would like you to tell me the biggest three car manufacturers in the world by number of vehicles sold. Okay, question eight. We're talking about the national anthems around the world. What do the national anthems of Spain, Kosovo, San Marino and Bosnia and Herzegovina have in common that is different to all of the rest? Okay, so those again, Spain, Kosovo, San Marino and Bosnia and Herzegovina. They have something in common that is different from all of the other national anthems around the world. What is it? Question nine. What does the word Uber mean in English? And finally, question 10, which is a two point question about the Titanic. For one point, tell me in which city was the Titanic built? And for the second point, which city did it leave on its fateful journey? And I found out recently, actually, after leaving that city, it did stop at two more places before heading into the Atlantic. Uh, So I'll give you an extra bonus point if you can tell me either of those. (laughs) 
pause the pod if you need more time with any of that or leave it playing for today's bad joke. This is today's bad joke. How do you think the unthinkable? With an iceberg. That was today's bad joke. See, as a theme joke, see so much thought goes into these quiz pod episodes for you folks. Okay, here come the answers. Let's see how you do. Feel free to celebrate with those around you if you get any right. Number one, pigeons can, in fact, uh, tell the difference between a Monet and a Picasso painting based on a 1995 study. There's a 175-page study which you can find online saying that pigeons successfully learn to discriminate colour slides of paintings by Monet and Picasso. Following the training, they discriminated novel paintings by Monet and Picasso that had never been presented during the training. So I guess you could say that we get the impression that pigeons know more about art than we thought. Surreal. Okay, number two, 1.15 miles measures a nautical mile. Number three, those phobias. Aerophobia is the fear of flying for one point. Arithmophobia is the fear of numbers for a second point. And anthophobia is the fear of flowers for the third point. Number four, where does Nestle originate? Switzerland. Number five, the Bowie album is Aladdin Sane, featuring the name of Aladdin. Number six, the last letter added to the alphabet in 1524 is the letter J for James. Uh, Prior to that, the I was used to make both I and J sounds. Number seven, three points here for your largest car manufacturers by unit sold. So I have the stats here. So in first place is Toyota with 7.9 million units sold, followed by Volkswagen with 6.5 million units sold. After that, you actually get some conglomerations of various car manufacturers. So Stellantis is third, which is a recent merger of Peugeot and Citroen, along with Chrysler and Opel. So I guess if you said any of those, we'll give you that. That was quite hard to get. The next one is Hyundai in fourth. So if you said any three of those four, I'll give you three points. Toyota, Volkswagen, Stellantis or Hyundai. Number eight, the national anthems of those four countries don't have any words. All of the other ones have words, but those four don't have any words. Number nine, the word Uber means taxi. I mean, super in English. And number 10, the Titanic. So it was made in Belfast for one point. It left Southampton for the second point. For the bonuses, it then went to Cherbourg. And then it went to Cove, which is the port of Cork. So have a point for any of those four names that you said. So quizzes, that was quite a good episode. Yeah, lots of uh, different stuff in there. Let us know what you think. We love to hear your feedback. If you've got Apple, write a review. If you have uh, Spotify, you can press the little Q&A bit. But we love to hear from you. So do let us know what you think about it. And we will see you next week. Bye! If you enjoyed today's quiz, why not book us for your next event? We host corporate events in the UK and Canada and virtual events all over the world. And don't forget to subscribe to the quiz pod so you never miss an episode. We'll see you next week. Quiz Coconut, nuts about trivia.